Hi, this is Jeff Cameron with Keller Williams. Thanks for tuning in for my real estate market report. Today we're talking about comparing foreclosure sales to short sale sales to retail sales. Retail is a owner occupant, or excuse me, an owner with equity selling the property. So um, this is for September 2010. Let's look at the numbers for foreclosure homes. Uh, they hit a high with 2,612 sales and sales closing in September. That was up 20% and they now make up 43.4% of the home closings. Um, now this could be due to the banks changing their position for closing on more homes, not giving as many people extensions on their short sale. REO pendings also increased to 23.6% of the market, uh, while available was at 20.8% of the market. Based on supply and demand, basically with REO homes, there's only a 2.5 month supply of homes, which is technically a seller's market. Home value should be going up, except for short sales. And short sales last month fell off a cliff. Now, the first landed on a Friday, so a lot of homes could have pushed into the following month. We'll see how next month's numbers come because we only closed 1,395 short sales last month, which was a 30.4% drop from the over 2,000 homes that sold in August as short sale. Um, they made up only 23.2% of the sales. Short sales continue to dominate the pending category where 53.7% of homes that are pending are short sales pending. Um, and then the active inventory is 31.6% of the market are short sales. When we look at retail sales, now I, I want to point out to folks so they understand the different categories of retail. You have really two basics. One is that owner with equity, somebody that bought it a while ago, put enough money down, they handled the, the market turn, and they can sell their home today because they have equity in it. And two is the um, the investors that are buying at the trustee sale fixing and flipping the homes these guys are helping our market too because they're selling homes at higher values helping bring up property values um, so with 33.5 percent of the homes being retail sales about half from unscientific studies they've done are in each of those categories so really less than 17 percent of the homes selling are people that live in their home with equity which is kind of disappointing if you're in that category uh, let's see looking at a couple of the other numbers here uh, da, 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 the inventory edged up 2% and pending homes up 5.9%. That's a good. Um, and gaining market share to 22.7%. Uh, all in all, REO markets, they dominate the sales. Short sales, they dominate the pending. And retail dominates the active. So um, hopefully that helped you. Just get a little more understanding of the product mix in the market. If you have any questions about real estate, short sales, retail, buying for uh, foreclosure homes, give me a call, Jeff Cameron at Keller Williams. Let me and my team help you, service you the best to get you the best deal or the highest price. Jeff Cameron, 480-502-7699. Make it a great day.